all about mentoring. I saw the look on your face when they talked about your father. You know, you're yeah. the main guy, but it's, it's kind of like you look like real humble. But that's my dad. Well, I mean, uh, yeah, I think we all think uh, very highly of our dads in uh, many ways. But uh, to me, certainly, uh, dad was uh, was uh, uh, was was my mentor. Was uh, someone that I trusted, and uh, dad played that role for many other many other kids. I mean, he did in the minor league system when he helped develop guys, and, and he also reached out to every community he was in to use baseball to get in front of kids that uh, didn't have all the advantages that, uh, you know, that we all grew up with. So for some reason, he felt a fatherly instinct, and uh, he used baseball to, to carve out those relationships, but, but he really taught about life when he did that. And in this case, what better mentors can you give young kids than police officers? Well, I mean, again, the magic of sport, you know, to get in front of kids. You know, sometimes you can uh, bring them in and it kind of breaks down all sort of walls and you just play. Uh, that concept, I think, is particularly important with baseball because baseball is sort of a magical sport that, that size doesn't dictate, you know, how you do in that sport. So when you uh, use that concept and you teach um, law enforcement a little bit about baseball and they go and trade and use baseball to create those mentorships, they are caring adults. They are the stand-up people in the community. The kids benefit from that. Law enforcement benefits from being seen in a positive way in that community. So it all works.